Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to access legacy file system drivers on your Windows 10 computer if you're currently blocked out of it on your administrator account on your Windows computer or perhaps even a standard account. So this should be a fairly straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu and you want to just type in CMD. Best match should say command prompt. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to left click on yes here. Now it says elevated command line window, you want to type in net, so NET space user space admin administrator. So admin A D M I N S T R A T O R space forward slash active colon yes. So again, net user administrator space forward slash active colon yes. Then you want to hit enter. Once you're done doing that, you can close out of the elevated command line window. Open back up the start menu. And now you want to left click on the little user icon right here. So left click on that. And now you want to left click on what it says administrator right here. So left click on that. It's going to switch us into the administrator account. So just left click on the sign in button. Should not require a password to sign in. Okay, so at this point, just try and run whatever drivers or programs you're experiencing the issue with. Once you've resolved the issues and you've installed whatever applications you were having problems with, you want to head back over to Start Menu, left click on the little person icon right here, and then you want to left click back into the account that currently says signed in right here. So left click on that account information. Now you want to enter in your computer password, and this is again after you've resolved your issue. And now you want to go back and open up a start menu again. Type in CMD. Best match should say command prompt or both desktop app. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. So now you want to type in net, so NET space user space admin administrator space forward slash active colon no, so one dot on top of another dot. Then you want to enter. It should say this command completed successfully. At this point you can close out of the command line window. So at this point you should be good to go. Restart your computer and that should be about it. So as always, thank you for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.